Hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. Oh my gosh, I have not done an unboxing for the longest time. No. You cannot come up here right now. You have to wait, okay? Wait. You're such a cutie. Um, anyways. Anyways, it's... Lux, relax. I hello. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Hola, hola. Welcome back to my channel. And today's video, I'm going to do a little bit of unboxing. And it's been a very long time. I don't even actually know if I've ever done an unboxing here on YouTube. I know I do them like on Instagram, the reels, the little quick ones, you know. Uh, pero no me acuerdo if I've done one here. Or does YouTube creators do any unboxing anymore? I don't know. Anyways, here we are. I'm going to share with you guys a little bit of skincare, uh, some new pieces to my wardrobe so I could, you know, just elevate it a little bit. And then I did a little bit of more shopping with luxurious brands. So that was a little Valentine's present for me. But anyways, let's get started. Let's start with... Um, my skincare. Oh, and before, please don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button down, and you know the rest. But anyways, uh, let's start with some skincare. Uh, I always get asked about my skincare. I'm gonna be 37. <laughs> I'm gonna be 37 uh, in two months, so I always get asked like, what do you use, what products, la la la, whatever, whatever, and I always tell them, no children, no husband, no man so is going to give me stress. And I also focus on good, clean beauty products, you know. Um, and most importantly, sunscreen. Sunscreen. So let's start with this one. This is the Summer Fridays SPF um, 30. Yeah, 30. And it smells kind of like it gives me like oatmeal scent. But oh... I like the finish. It's not super, super dewy, but it does give you like a little bit of texture that if you would want to put your makeup on top of, obviously of it, este, it will have like a nice hold to it. Um, so yeah, I've been using Summer Fridays, I don't know, for like a couple of years since they came out with the SPF. I tried it. I really enjoyed it. And I think it's like my fourth, fifth bottle of sunscreen that I've used. I tried another one. Um, but it made me break out. It was like doctor or something. Anyways, it made me break out. But oh, before that, before Summer Fridays, I was using the Biosense um, SPF. But they discontinued it because I guess they were, it was making people break out or something. So, and I really love that finish because it gave me more of a dewy finish. And how I said this one gives you like dewy but matte finish. No sample. I really really like it um, so that's that so next up are these two Kaduli Kadali I'm probably butchering the name but anyways I got this spray or like the mist and it's for smoothing glowing complexion um, I really really like it and I use this at night and in the morning too so I use it twice a day so this one right here is for instant firming uh, serum. So it's like a nice lift for your face. And I use this one at night. Um, but for the day, Ole Hendrickson. And I got this trio at Sephora a couple of days ago. Actually like two weeks ago. I got the Bright Banana Eye Cream. And I always put this one under my obviously eyes and I bring it all the way down and it just pat 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 all the way up here um and it gives like a nice little like glow to it and shimmer shimmer and then I follow with the C Rush Brightening Gel Cream three source of vitamin C and rose winter extract and it's just been so freaking dry in Arizona that ugh, it just eats it all up and then after, I follow with this serum, which is Collagen Boosting True with True C Complex. Um, and yeah, this is, this is what I do afterward. Um, and I just put a little bit like one pump and I just disperse it and pat it into my skin. This one, I haven't 
quite fully like tried it because it is a retinol and I do have some other products right now that I'm using and I don't want to like overdo it because I don't I forgot what I put on my eyelids and my eyelids got so freaking dry like that you could see it's freaking dry so I don't want to like overdo obviously my skin or damage my skin um, but this one is the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair and this one I heard so many good things about it you guys but como les digo I haven't tried it myself but I can't wait to, to try it. But I, I want to finish my other products first before I start going in on this one. Um, and that is it for skincare. So I'm going to move on with some Oakley glasses. Uh, I went to Oakley and they had a buy one, get one, half off kind of deal. So these are the... These are the ones that I got. This is the packaging that they come in. It's like a nice sturdy uh, case. You do look that I so little pouch. These are it. Oh. <laughs> I really, really like them. I couldn't decide of which ones I wanted, but I love like the full coverage that it gives me and especially out here in Arizona, it's so bright. And if I'm hiking, I want it like to be like nice and secure in my face. And they're super, super, super light. And that's one of my things going sunglasses that sunglasses, if they're too tight, it gives me a headache and I have to take them off and you know, I'm sensitive to light and la 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 and all that good stuff. But yeah, I got this pair and I don't know if the name is Ever Zero Blades or if that's just the style of the boat of the um the frame. But anyways, the number is 0009454. So if you guys wanna look them up and I said they're super super light in the face. Um so I'm excited to use these whenever I go hiking. Um because I know they're gonna give me a really good protection and how I said they're are super light. And then the next the next ones are called BXTR. And these remind me of like the 80s. And I'm an 80s baby. I'm a late 80s baby, but still, you know, it just brought me a little bit of nostalgia. And they're super cool, they're funky, like the colors, like look at this. These are so freaking dope. Um, those other ones are more like, you know, casual. But these are more like funky style, have fun with them. And how I said, like, they're super light and they don't fall off or anything. Um, it gives me full coverage as well. The only thing I'm noticing is that I'm able to see the blue. I don't know if that's gonna bother me actually. Biddle. I haven't taken them for a hike because I've been going super, super, super early that by the time that the sun is going up is cuando I'm already coming down. So I really haven't been using them or need them right now. But now that I unboxed them, I'm definitely going to be using them. I just wanted to save them for today's video, I guess you could say. Alrighty. Okay, so moving on to dun, 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 my wardrobe. A little bit of online shopping at Love Bonita. Este, so I got these two items. And so the reason why I got two bags is because I couldn't decide the size of, of this blazer. And it's beautiful white. I saw, I saw one girl wearing it and it looked really good on her, but I'm petite, but I don't know like if she's smaller than me. So she said that she was wearing the extra small. So I got small. And it looks like this. 
and you guys the quality it's so it feels really really good let me try it on I'm actually gonna be shooting all of this on Monday so I'll show you guys oh yeah I'm so glad that I went with the small the shoulder pads a little bit there's a little bit of padding going on um but yeah this is the blazer pero agarré también los pantalones but how i said i couldn't decide like the size like i was thinking of getting a size small anyways but because how i said i saw her another girl and she's pretty petite yeah um if it's this one fits perfect 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 and then these are a couple of pants and the pants that go with that jacket. So let's uh, wave the pants. So obviously I haven't tried any of this stuff on and some of this stuff was final sale so if it doesn't fit me I'm SOS you guys the quality on these pans are unreal it's so oh, so nice but it's some pantalones we're gonna go with the blazer and the blazer and the pants are a little bit of a different uh texture and and material but all still feels nice and these are size four so this is how they look this is how they look and then they have like a wide uh leg i'm excited to fully try them on and go shooting with them because you guys um but I'm super excited to show you guys these and just get out there and start shooting, creating content and everything. Like I need to, I need to get that side of my life together. I've been focusing on Wonders with Skin for three years. So that's why I haven't done YouTube or I've been trying to do YouTube. I don't know. And I don't know. And you, uh, Wonders with Skin actually is my provider like when it comes to shmane. So you have to pay attention to what's providing you money, you know? Um, pero, I just need to focus on my fashion side too. I saw this um, video the other day and it's a medicine man that he talks about um, your spiritual path and like your personal path. And you could compromise with your personal path your personal wants, needs, desires, or whatever, but you could not compromise on your spiritual path. And I watched it several times because it's very true. Like, I don't know if, if I ever share with you guys, but um, Wonders with Skin is actually a magic shop. Um, I provide all four elements to create your own magic, candle magic or your bath rituals, your bath magic, your limpias. Um, so I hand pour all the body shape candles. I, you know, dress them, I activate them. Uh, my healing salts, like everything I do in ceremony. Uh, on Thursdays, I work at Elements of Spirit, which Gypsy, the owner, my Maya set up birth fire, that's her other name, um, is the, and that's where I learned a lot of my magic and a lot of my spells and uh, I just, I love, love the spiritual bruja side of things and opening more my third eye and be able to see, see, and really see, um, and just expand my magic and my gifts and everything so it takes a lot like it takes a lot of time and a lot of ceremony because you can't just be like universe give me give me give me no like you need to do ceremony you need to do a lot of things um and i love it like i i love i love being a bruja i love 
actually following my intuition and following like what my actual path or if you would want to say like my um my journey here in this earth you know but always i am a bougie bruja and i always say that like i'm like i love expensive things i love luxurious things i am a tourist like hello we love money 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 so that's why i've been focusing on wonders with skin because not it's just not providing me income but it's my spiritual path too like assisting others to create their own magic or teach them how to do their own limpias or me giving them recipes to give you know for them to do their own limpias and get rid of like the bad energy because there's a lot the fucking evil eye anyways my thing turned off because it's too hot but anyways it's the yeah like uh helping with like the evil eye um envy like hate like you know, people could be very, very, very fucking catty. So just, you know, protecting yourself and practicing that self-love. And that's what I'm all about. Of course, there's other brujos that practice other things and you're gifted in other things. But that's what I focus in. So that's the whole spiel on why I haven't been consistent on YouTube. But here we are. Este, I need a... Now I feel like I'm able to balance both worlds, I guess you could say. So, what's my way to chopping and, you know, just be here. Um, anyways, let's move on to the second pair of trousers. So, these are brown and the same thing, wide leg. And I can't wait to use these. I feel like these are going to be really good also for the summer porque they're not too thick. The white ones had like a little bit of a thicker material, pero... Yeah, I'm excited to use these. And como que está, like, a A-frame. Can't wait to shoot this. And yeah, this is our size 4 también. I feel like they might not fit me on the waist. I need to stop eating rice. <laughs> um, and candy and stuff, you guys. I've been, like, I went hard on a little sweet tooth again. And it's really, really bad. Anyway, so finally the last ones. So these are a dark brown, and once again, the material is so soft, so freaking good. Let's do this thing. See, and it's also a wide leg, and I feel like these are supposed to fit more loose, um, more like of a boyfriend or grandpa style kind of thing. So, yeah. I'm super excited. So that is from La Bonita. And then this one is from Alice or something. Because of Alice. So I got also a couple of trousers. All right. So I got like a little suit action going on for Because of Alice. And this is the jacket. Oh my gosh. Like, these are such a good quality. Like, this is a jacket. And it feels like very, like, nice quality también. Let me just do a little try on. I keep on seeing this brand on Instagram, so I said, why not? Let's give it a try. Obviously, I'll be having my hair straight. But yeah, it has like a little bit of a padding action. Super padding. Anyways, but you'll see, I like it. I like how it fits. And these are supposed to fit like loose as well, so I'm not... The only thing I'm just like... Wondering is about the padding because there's like really no padding in the back. It's just all the padding in the front I don't know. I'll figure out. But oh, yeah, it seems a very good quality. I like it. I like it And let me show you the pants So how I said this one is from because of Alice and then the trousers Are these I love the top, como like, it gives it a little bit of a, like, 
waist moment like it focuses i feel like when they have like those little pinches up here is they, they focus on like the waist so it doesn't get lost even though it's like baggy um and again like a straight wide leg so yeah i'm gonna use yeah that was and then the last thing that i got from because of alice are these black trousers and i just feel uh with all these colors of black the white and gray they're essential colors so they're essential pieces you know um but these are like the gray ones they have like the little pinch on the waist and then once again the straight leg i would go on middle look at this i'm five one so we shall we shall see how these fits but yeah these are the last uh items for my wardrobe that i've got well i don't know i don't know if you would consider workout clothes part of your wardrobe i guess you could but i end up getting some i end up getting some stuff from csb and they had just dropped like a new collection or something but oh my god these are fucking small look at these <laughs> like look at these these are size small okay I guess they're gonna be like really, really tight on my booty. These are super, super small. I feel like these are like for a seven year old. <laughs> um, but I got some shorts and they didn't really have a lot of like the pink selection that I wanted. Everything was already sold out. So I ended up getting these um, also a little more of a fuchsia pink. Um, these are size small tambien and pretty stretchy and the, you guys like the quality and all of this stuff it's very impressive and then i got some leggings because i have one pair of leggings only and these are size small too but they seem pretty stretchy pretty good and how i said the quality and all of this very very nice totally worth every penny and then i think this is like the newest collection that they came out and it's like a little tank top that you could wear on top of your you know your sports bra or just an everyday type of thing so i know i'll be using this one for sure during the summer because it is a no joke out here and then for my sports bra i got this one and it's an open back so I'm excited to start using these. Right now it's been still like pretty cold in the mornings and it's been raining out here in, in Arizona. So I'll be wearing the leggings um, and a t-shirt kind of thing, sweater kind of thing. But for these for the summer, like how cute is this? Super cute. Okay, so this is it for the wardrobe, for the clothing part. And let me show you guys what I got from... Dun, dun, dun. Dior. <laughs> All right, I kind of cleaned up everything because I didn't want my doggies to eat the little beets. But all, anyways, my shit is about to, uh, my battery is about to die. So let's do this one really quick. Um, so <laughs> I I went shopping. How I said so. I did a little bit of shopping how I said. I went to Dior and oh, I just I have a shopping problem. But anyways, let's do the first shoe. Um, I'm obsessed with these two other both collections. Once they're gone, they're gone. And I think she said um, the girl that was helping me out at uh, Dior, she said that they made only like 300 pairs of each pair, like each pair of shoes that I got. So I don't know it's like a little bit of psychologically like I don't know if it's like a little bit of a psychology like you need to get them now kind of thing um but oh yeah and then I'm gonna reuse the bows for my hair but anyways como estoy diciendo the first ones dun 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 I am super excited for these shoes for both of them actually so Estos primero, I feel like they're a little bit more classy, kind of vintage looking. And 
It comes with two little bags, uh, like dust bags, like travel bags for your shoes. And are you guys ready? <gasps> dun, dun, dun. How gorgeous. Se me. My battery died. So let me do this pretty quick because also it's getting kind of cloudy. So the lighting is changing. Pero como le estaba enseñando. How cute are these? Like, okay, here's it gonna pick it up or what? How cute are these, you guys? I am obsessed, obsessed, obsessed with the heel, the little star in the back, and oh, don't they look like vintage? Me encantan, me encantan, me encantan. As soon as I saw them, I was actually gonna go just for like your classic pump that they have all year round. But once I saw these, I'm like, um, never mind. I want these definitely. So I'll be pairing up these with the new items that I got. So these are the first ones. My battery's about to die again because I didn't want to charge fully. So these that I got are a collection um, in a collaboration with Frida Caldo. So they gifted me this magazine and oh, it's just, let me see, I think I have something in here, yeah. My receipt, but how gorgeous are these photos? So I can't wait to go through this magazine and just use it for all these photo props and backdrops and all that good stuff but anyways it's also on the collaboration that happened with Frida Caldo and let's I just guess I'm in with otra vez the battery but you guys are gonna freaking die for these ta-da these as soon as I saw them, because I was waiting for the girl just to like bring me a couple of sizes out, and I turned the corner and they had these in display, I was like, mm, could I try these on? Oh, yes, I'm gonna be at this stuff. But look at, obviously these are not real pearls, but oh, look at the detail, and it has a C, uh, D, and it has a C, D, um, oh, good luck. um, on them, I don't know if you could see it. And look, at the, and look at the detail it has like the little cd on the pearls and it has a rose and a cute little heel like just for my grandma's self but ugh, obsess 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 i love also um these are square so like my foot's not gonna be all like my children are not gonna be super cramped or anything and these even though these are pointy um if it's perfect, like if it's perfect like a glove, as soon as they enter, they fit really well. They're not like squished or anything. And how I said, I love the little stars in the back. I'm like in shoe heaven. <laughs> oh, these are very, very different, but I love it. I just love adding these to my collection and, and yeah, just and start using them i'm gonna i want to start taking myself out to dinner at least once a month to a, like a nice fancy dinner or just a nice dinner period so because obviamente if you don't got a man that's gonna do it you might as well do it yourself you know we don't we don't need a man girls we could romanticize ourselves we could give ourselves this was my valentine's gift for myself so and then i've been working really hard <laughs> Really, really hard. Uh, so I said, Jacqueline, you deserve them. Ah, y eso que fui no más. I just went in to do. I just went to do or just to buy one pair of the other like classic pumps, and that was it. And I walked out with two pairs. So, yeah, treat yourself, ladies.